Hi, I'm back with the Daring Cosmic Tidbit, and this is a continuing monologue about our consciousness. And I said that our consciousness, our feelings, they affect everything, and that everything has consciousness, including the molecules. Well, you know what? That means that you can actually affect the weather around you. Now, way back before I knew any of this, but I knew that I, I could affect certain things. There was one year when um, my family and I decided to go visit Jamaica on a, on a vacation. And it was actually during a really bad hurricane season <laughs> that summer. But I had decided that we were going to go on this vacation and we were going to have a good time regardless of how the weather was going to be. So I made my plans, I made uh, our travel plans, booked our hotel, and so we went. So apparently on the day that we arrived in Jamaica, the weather had already turned pretty good. And I had been watching the weather reports in Jamaica for quite a while. So I saw that in a particular week that it looks like it's gonna be okay. So I booked, I guess, trusting that everything was gonna work out. So we arrive, we're there for a week and it was bright and sunny and just beautiful and very hot, okay? So it was so hot, I remember it was, the sand was too hot to even walk on barefoot, but it was a beautiful week. And it only started to rain on the day that we were leaving. So our feelings, our thoughts make things happen, good, bad, ugly, beautiful, or neutral. That was a very important lesson for me, but I didn't understand until in recent years why that happened and why many other things have happened before and since then. Okay, think about what you're thinking, how you're feeling, how it actually really does have a direct effect on your life. I'll see you in the next Cosmic Tidbit. Bye.